But uh, Jacob, how would you describe Damien and Betsy's relationship? Um, I think they're both kind of at the place, especially Damien, where he wants to take the next step and he wants to propose. And I think for him, it feels like this is the girl that he wants to spend the rest of his life with. Um, and that ultimately is kind of what brings him from the beginning of the story to the very end. He goes through a lot. <laughs> he does, the poor guy. The course oh of the night. Why is he so intent on proposing this evening? I think it's one of those like, quintessential people that think that this has to go according to plan and like not really being totally open to just letting it flow and letting it happen and he's super neurotic about getting it right and making her happy and the parents happy and so I think that that ultimately causes him a lot of stress. I just love Betsy's personality and she has some great lines throughout the film. Was there anything you particularly added to her, Joanna, that may not have been in her initial breakdown? Um, I, you know, I don't know. There, we weren't really given a breakdown for this. Um, Will just came with the script and, you know, we got to bring whatever we really wanted to, to the character personality wise, I think. Um, but I didn't like add any lines or anything. That was all like Will's vision from day one. I, I just have so many amazing moments throughout this film that stand out to me. What do you, what are some of yours? Obviously, I guess, Jacob, for you is diving in the pool, finding the ring. And what were each of you uh, favorite moments you had from filming the movie? I love the end, the scenes with Betsy. I really like a lot of my scenes with Lucas, who, who's played by Chad Werner. I think we had a lot of chemistry and a lot of fun, like making that relationship be something. Um, so all of my stuff with Chad and honestly, like all of my stuff with Joe, I really love too. Yeah, same. I love the ending scene with um, Jacob and I loved our uh, scene with Chad in the restaurant. Um, and then I also really liked the scene out where um, Caleb has a cigarette just like that weird dynamic of like, oh, should I be talking to my ex like this? But like, it feels so familiar. Like that, that was really fun to play out as well. Did you guys get to spend much time together before filming this? Because you all have great chemistry as well. Was there any time for you all to spend time together and build kind of a Betsy Damien dynamic? Or did you guys just jump right into filming? Well, we have known each other for years. We worked together on a show, Quantico, a little bit, yeah. like five or six years ago. And so that was actually one of the things that made me really want to do it is because we knew each other so we could kind of bring our own chemistry to it. And it wasn't just like meeting somebody with cold feet, you know? It was important for Damien Betsy to, I think, to have that kind of history. Yeah, totally. The movie is just a beautiful, modern, <laughs> comedic romp. What do you think it is, Joanna, about this movie that's going to make it such a fast fan favorite? Um, I think it has so much heart. And also, even though it's modern day, it feels nostalgic. Um, I think all of the characters are so fleshed out that you can just relate to all of them and you care about all of them. So I think... I think ultimately the characters and the people will draw you in. Jacob, you're a part of social media. Are you looking forward to the fan response you're gonna be receiving when the movie comes out? Yeah, I'm excited to see it. You know, we, I think throughout making it, I was excited for people to see it and seeing the finished product, I'm excited for people to see it. And like Joe said, it has so much heart and it's funny and it's fun. And I'm looking forward to seeing what everyone thinks. What was it like working with Will Bakey on this? It, it must have been very freeing, but also, you know, <laughs> just a wild time. It was great. I mean, it was a whirlwind because it was, you know, it was a shorter shoot and it was all at night. We had, we were fighting the sun every day. Um, but Will's so great. I've worked with Will before and he, you know, we were, Jacob and I were talking about how he's, he's so clear on what he wants. Like he is not unprepared. He knows exactly what he wants, which gives the actors so much faith and confidence that like, we're not moving on until we know that 
he's got it. Um, he's, yeah, he's so great to work with. What's next for both of you, Jacob? Will we see you singing and dancing again soon? And we loved you on the small screen, Joanna. Yeah, and all these I'm, <laughs> um, I'm actually doing it during quarantine. I started working on a project that's behind the scenes as opposed to in front of the camera. So I'm excited to kind of put that new hat on and be doing that. Will we be seeing you on our small screens again soon, Joanna? Uh, well, I have a film coming out. I'm pretty sure it'll be video on demand as well. And I think it's in the fall. It's called Saving Paradise. I'm not sure, but I will, I will post about it when I get the date. Well, is there anything else about your time here on the get together you want to be sure we share with our viewers and readers? Just that it's a really wonderful movie. It's really funny. Courtney Parchman, who's average fashion blogger on social media, she is so funny and so charismatic and charming. And the movie has, like we've been saying, a lot of heart and it's a good time. Yeah, I think, I think you'll feel like you went to a party afterwards. I hope you do. And I hope you feel like you know all the characters and it just sparks fun conversations.